and welcome to my uh, playthrough of Portal 2. I am Bill from Deploy Gaming and today we are going to be just going straight through Portal 2. Let's go. Here we go. Good morning. You have been in suspension for 50 days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Oh, wow. oh God. Uh, look up, look up. Good. Yeah. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Good. Okay. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory <laughs> physical and mental wellness exercise. There is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. Oh, no. This that. is art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, Stare at the art. Wow, this is amazing. Lovely. You should now feel mentally reinvigorated. <laughs> if you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. <laughs> good. Now please return to your bed. Wow, so far so, so far so good. You know, just looking around. A lamp, microwave. TV. Can't live without TV. Where's the remote? The, where's the remote? Where, oh, oh god, I'm sleeping! Ah! I'm getting to bed. No, I didn't mean to sleep. Uh, sleep on the bedside table. Good morning. You have been in suspension for nine, 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 Exercised his oh. order right. I knew oh. so. Ah, dog, dog. You look um good, looking good actually. Are you okay? How are you? Well, don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take. Some. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Oh, stay calm. Stay, stay calm. Prepare. It's all I'm saying. Prepare. It's all fine. All right. Don't move. I'm gonna get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. How do you hang on to something? I'm standing here. Again. Oh god, what's going on? Okay, the up. Can you hear me? The TV's on. Hello? Uh, we are experiencing technical difficulties. Well, how come that's on then? Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. Okay, but really? don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although if you do if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. <laughs> do you understand what I'm saying at all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me, just say yes. Oh, could speak. Oh, but that's jump, isn't it? Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. <laughs> uh, you just you just jumped. But never mind. Say apple. Apple. Um Okay, you know what? That's close enough. Just one time. <laughs> Okay, now scared. All reactor core safeguards are now non-functional. Please prepare for reactor core meltdown. Who's trying to get? I can't get in here. Oh. Okay, look, I wasn't going to mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. Oh god, what's going on? What are you doing down there? You still holding on? Ah. The reserve power ran out, so of course the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Hold on, this is a bit tricky. Oh god. Of course. Nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Why should I be kept informed? You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. Why? It's close. Can you see? Am I going to make it through? But not enough space. Oh, don't uh, wait, wait, you can just, do it. Just got to get through here. Uh, I just got to concentrate. So you're about to fall, do you think it's gonna be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? Oh. Alright, so now I hit that one. I hit that one. Oh. Oh. What's going okay, on? Listen, we should get our story straight, alright? If anyone asks, and no one's gonna ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive. Alright? <sighs> Not dead. <sighs> Okay, almost there. On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. Okay. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. This is docking station. 
Oh god. Ah! Boom. Good news, that is not a docking station. So there's one mystery solved. Uh, I'm going to attempt a manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Hold on. Oh god. Ah! Flip. Almost there. Remember, you're looking for a gun that makes holes. Not bullet holes. But don't worry, you'll figure out. Seriously, do hold on this time. Oh god. Now, I'll be honest, you are probably in no fit state to run this particular type of cognitive gauntlet. But, um, at least you're a good jumper. So, you got that, got the jumping on your side. Um, just do your best, and I'll meet you up ahead. Okay, thanks, Wheatley. Wheatley's a nice name for a robot, isn't it? All right, it? off you go. Thanks, Wheatley. Okay. Hello. Hello. And again, welcome to the Aperture Science Enrichment Center. Lost. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance <laughs> beyond our control. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. The portal will open, and emergency testing will begin in three, Two, one. Oh, it's a portal. I know this. Oh, there's me. Hello, me. Oh, we're through. Cube and button based testing remains an important tool for science, even in a dire emergency. If cube and button based testing cause this emergency, don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. Let's do it. Oh. Please note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture science material emancipation grill will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through. <laughs> GLaDOS in the last game. Sorry, should have probably said spoiler alert. I'll do it now. Spoiler alert. Uh, Wheatley, um, not Wheatley. GLaDOS is dead. If you feel liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. <laughs> you are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. That's lovely, isn't it? What's going on? Oh, there's the thing on Bobby. So we want that one, don't we? To get to this, to take it out again. Then we want to open this one. And then we want to take this one through to that one. Put the button thing in my Bobby down and walk through. Oh, um. There we go. Ah, simple. Be a lot simpler than the Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Before re entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will remind you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. That's lovely, isn't it? Lovely news. Okay, so Glarus is dead. I'm just telling you here. Okay, Glarus is dead. And, you know, that's about it. So far we don't have a portal gun, which is a bit disappointing. Aperture laboratories. Laborator laboratories. If the Earth is currently governed by a manner of animal king, sentient cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable of listening to us. Animal king takeover. So this is what an animal king takeover would be like. Wow. So, uh, so like a few people praying it. Along there, really. Mm, okay, that's fun. Okay, so we're gonna go through this way. Through this way. Hey, you made it! Oh, oh hi, Wee! There should be a, a portal device on that podium over there. Oh, the, oh. I can't see it though. Maybe it fell off. Do you want to go have a quick look? Oh! oh. Hello? Don't expect much. 
next right now. Can you see the portal gun? Okay, uh, no. Oh, no, okay. So, are you alive? If that's important, should have asked that first. I'm, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to work on the assumption that you're still alive, and I'm just going to wait for you up ahead. I'll wait, I'll wait one hour, then I'll come back, and assuming I can locate your dead body, I'll bury you. All right? Brilliant. Go team! See you Is in this... an hour, hopefully. If you're not dead, Okay, so this is a painting, I think, of me. It's being GLaDOS thing. Cave painting. Type device thing. Okay, so we're gonna go through here. Into here. And down here. Some emergency testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with a copy of the laws of robots. To share. Good. If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. That's good. Okay. So that was pretty good. Pretty good level that was. So Wheatley again, but mm, kind of lost him again. Poor Wheatley, all alone. I, li I like the character Wheatley. He's kind of got um, he's got a nice sort of, you know, feeling to him. Sort of quite cute, quite small. This next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed in three, two, one. Ooh, yeah. Oh, I was happy about that. Oh, I like that smooth jazz. I want to play more of that smooth jazz. Test in number four. Four out of 19. Are these the tests that you face in? I don't know, they might be. Oh, here we go. Wow, it's getting complex. Oh, I'll have to go down there too. Oh. And um, I'm guessing you gotta like, jump down here or something? Gain some momentum? I'm, I'm not sure. How do we get. I don't, I, don't, I don't understand. Oh, I understand. Oh, this is pretty easy. Oh, well. Just to figure it out, silly me. Thank you. Okay, I'm not, I'm not stupid, don't worry. Great work. Because this message is pre-recorded, any observations related to your performance are speculation on our part. Please disregard any undeserved compliments. Oh, wow, just smash the glass. Put this away. I, I, I could go in there, or I could go up these stairs. Okay, um, is that the cat jumping over the moon? Is that in the, I don't know what that rhyme is called, isn't it that weird one, like, something, isn't it the cow that jumped over the moon or is it the cat? I'm not sure, it's a computer, could be if you could like, play on the computer. And that does, we can smash it with this, smash! No, it's not working, let's go. Let's go down. Let's go. Another ball. 